Hello YouTubers, I'm going to discuss uh, Windows Mobile 6.5. That's the new operating system that Microsoft will be debuting on October 6, 2009. And it will become available for anyone that has a 6.1 on their devices. For example, my uh, T-Mobile Touch Pro 2, which is right here. The uh, uh, other carriers uh, that are coming out with phones in uh, around that time will most likely have 6.5 installed. And those people that recently bought, for example, the Touch Pro 2 will be getting it as a free uh, update or upgrade, whatever you want to call it. But most of us have gone, most of us, some of us have gone on to uh, XDA developers or uh, to a site called the Wingster W-I-N-G-S-T-E-R the Wingster.com and he provides an excellent uh, source for getting the latest ROMs uh, he has explanations and he has them available for download and even screenshots very nicely done compared to XDA developers uh, where you pretty much are on your own. You either know what you're doing or just forget it. On the Wingster, and that's again T H E W I N G S T E R dot com, I'll provide a link in the info box. Uh, on that site, he walks you through the, uh, the various ROMs, describes them, has the screenshots, and has them available for download. Anyway, the purpose of this video is not to discuss all that. It's to uh, talk about, uh, which is a really cool feature that's coming up uh, on 6.5, and which I have on installed on my phone here. This is the this this particular uh, ROM that I have on here, and ROM is another name for an operating system. Is uh, Windows Mobile 6.5, the energy. Uh, energy ROM version uh, and it's the standard he, he calls it the standard so uh, and that may, by he I mean the developer so uh, what Microsoft is coming up with is remember on the old Windows Windows Mobile uh, uh, system you you had a site called in pocket PC days Windows CE days you had a, 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 a sites like Handango and other sites that had programs available for download. Remember they were really super expensive and it was always a hassle getting them because you had to go to like on Handango you'd have to go there uh, buy the program which were always like 10, 15, 20 dollars and then install it uh, uh, onto your device and then uh, you could either install it through ActiveSync or you could go onto your device and press the cab folder and all that cab file. Well, uh, those of you that have used the, an Android-based phone, such as the G1, which is what I have, know that uh, they have a really successful feature called Android Market, which you click it and you can immediately download and install various programs uh, and applications. That's been so successful that Microsoft is copying it and they are copying it because even their logos they shamelessly copy uh, the Android market logo at least in terms of, of style and by that I mean the Android market uh, icon is a, uh, a green shopping bag with a little Android caricature on it well here's what Microsoft is doing let's see we'll go to my programs and right here at the top is the Microsoft what they're going to call it the marketplace and here it is and what it is is a blue shopping bag with the Windows logo the white Windows logo in it Let's see if I can get that to focus See it right there in the middle. So 
to me, that's that's pretty. Sh uh, you know, you have no shame if you're copying it to that degree. But no matter, they can do that all they want because I want a marketplace. I don't like going to Hand Dango. I hate that place, and uh, other places have uh, on the net have software for download, obviously, uh, but. I, I just never have liked Handango where you go on there and you pay your five dollars, ten dollars, whatever. They give you sometimes a trial period to use the program, and then after that you bought it, you know, and on and on. And if you don't want it, you got to ask for a refund. What a mess! So I'm looking forward to this. Uh, the marketplace. I guess they're going to call this what Windows Mobile Marketplace, uh, but they just call it marketplace here. It's going to have, uh, they say, so far there's about 4,000 applications on there. And many of them are going to be for free. That's cool because that's what Android Market is. It's a lot of free apps that you can just download instantly and use. And that's just really cool to be able to do that. What happens when I click this? Well, it goes to the Marketplace site. However, here's what you find when you go there. How about that? A coming soon. And they tell you what all is going to be there. And there's that word premium again. Microsoft loves that word premium, don't they? They talked about in that other video I have posted on upcoming 6.5, they mentioned that word premium. They're going to have a premium experience for, uh, uh, if you pay for it, a premium experience with your mobile operating system. And then there's going to be us jerks sitting there with our standard version. Just like they set up uh, uh, the Windows operating system where they have the, the premium experience versus the home and the basic versions. So this is what you see when you click on the site, but it's good to see that they're coming up with it, and, and I look forward to it. To, to, I especially look forward to the Discover Free apps, and the download instantly to your phone. That's what, what, what I, on my G1, I just love that, that feature that aspect of, of the Android system was the market and that's been hugely successful which is why Microsoft is copying it so just uh, just wanted to mention that we're all looking forward to it uh, I am anyway and uh, make sure you tune in to see what 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 they what they come up with all right that's it let's see I'll go back uh, home and that's it. Goodbye. For once, I haven't used up all my time.